Andro on the pitch and Ryan is predicting a 6-0 win for the Toffees. Be nice, wouldn't it? Kieran Dowell, edge of the penalty area. Runs at the defence, takes it wide, crosses across the middle, and Leighton Baines slides home. The first goal of the Marco Silva era, less than five minutes into the game. Good play from Kieran Dow. Lovely ball into the box. Nice little finish by Leighton Baines. Nice choice of music as well to accompany the first Everton goal. And Leighton Baines joins Apostolos Velios and Brendan Galloway in a very exclusive group. Apostolos Velios scored the first goal of the Roberto Martinez era. Brendan Galloway scored the first goal of the Ronald Koeman era in a pre-season friendlies, both of whom were in Austria. Lovely ball across and Leighton Baines in an advanced position. What was Leighton Baines doing in the six-yard box, by the way? And he slid the ball home. To, uh, Dr. Shahir over on the far side. And uh, rather gingerly, Adam Miller Luckman makes his way to the sidelines and Kieran Dowell with his uh, wand of a left foot, will drift the ball into the penalty area. James Tosin, Michael Keane, Mason Holgate, Morgan Schneiderlin are in there waiting. Dow looks for the back stick. Schneiderlin heads it goes. It's a really good save. They're queuing up to finish it, and in the end, it's Mason Holgate. The prods in inside. Now Adam Luckman's had his, uh, his Achilles wrapped, and that will be quite painful. I'm sure, though, Marco Silva will give virtually everybody a bit of game time at some point this afternoon. DFC Live is the hashtag. Everton leading by two goals to nil. Twelve and a half minutes gone here in Austria. Drilled across by Kieran Dow. Keane goes up again, and this time it counts. Michael Keane gets his goal. He back of the net, and David Gabriel, the kebab-loving stopper of ATV Erding, is in for a long, long afternoon, I fear. Well, they don't always go to plan these pre-season games against unknown opposition. And there's a nice little setup here at ATV Erdning. What an awful ball. Jenk Toten is bearing down on goal on his left foot, and he goes for goal, and he finds goal. It was a terrible mistake by Sebastian Schmidt. And Jenk Toten looking for Toten. Dowell. Toten, Dowell. Good stuff from Everton. Now, can Adam Ola Luckman add his name to the score sheet? No, decent save. Falls for Sandro, though. Right hand side of the penalty area, and Jen Tosin makes it 5 0. But uh, I've not been uh, witness to them, and I have a feeling my 8 0 record is going to go possibly before half time here. Tom Davis clips it forward, and they're, again they're wide open at the back. Adam Ola Luckman, edge of the penalty area, he's going to dance through himself every time Everton go forward. They score a goal, and it's 6 0. 17 minutes gone. Off. Coleman skips past one, past two, nice play. Sandro Ramirez brings it forward, puts a little bit of pace into the Everton attack, slides it wide to Seamus Coleman. Towards Adamola Luckman, good control by Adamola Luckman. Can he get a shot away? No, he's closed down, but he might get a second chance, and he does, and he finishes it with a plum. It's a good on the pitch. I think it was against West Ham. No, it was against Reading. That day we drew 1-1, Sylvester Stallone on the pitch. What a surreal sight that was, uh, Alex. I remember it really well. Here's Morgan Schneiderlin. You're watching Everton TV live here from Austria. We're trying to make it as interactive as we can. It's a lovely ball. Hat trick for Tosin. 8 0. Adam Ola Luckman, who's got two himself, finds Jen Tosin. Here's Tosin, here's Adam Ola Luckman, can he reach it? Oh, I tell you what, just about Adam Ola Luckman finds the top corner. They are minds during the summer, and each and every Evertonian will be fiercely proud of a certain Jordan Pickford. Here comes Adam Ola Luckman, you've got Tosin alongside him, this time Tosin's onside. Keeper gets one hand to it, but Tosin will dribble the ball into the back of the net to get his fourth goal. Of Inside the penalty area, good block. Good fierce challenge, that, from John Joe Kenny. That was a Kirkdale challenge, that, in the heart of Austria. Kevin Morales. 
to Umonias. Good turn by Umonias and a good little save by David Gabriel. He got a hand to it, but uh, couldn't stop Kevin Morales from prodding in goal number 11. Can he do so again with his left foot? Yes, he can. The keeper comes for it and the keeper makes a nice safe catch. And then gives the ball straight to Kevin Morales, who finds the back of the net. Well, that is David Gabriel's afternoon summed up in a matter of seconds. Nice tidy catch, poor distribution. What Kevin Morales fancies it as well. That'd be something, wouldn't it? A hat-trick in six minutes. Kevin Morales with his right foot pulls seniority and waves away Kieran Dowell. Now then. Has a little look at it, Kevin Morales over the wall and into the back of the net and Kevin Morales has scored a hat-trick in less than six minutes and it's on lucky 13. We didn't he for Seamus Coleman last season, 100% born and bred scouser, lovely kid by the way, John Joe Kenny. Anthony Robinson to Morales. Plays a 1-2 with Vlasic and Kevin Morales is going to dance through the defence before finding the back of the net for his fourth goal of the game. Everton lead 14-0 and Kevin Morales has scored four goals. On his right foot, little outswinger. Oh, Ashley Williams was poised to nod that goal with Mo Bezic. Tidies up. Kuko Martina finds Mikola Vlasic. Vlasic, got three defenders in front of him, spins away, finds Umarnias, and Umarnias tucks it away sweetly into the bottom corner, and Everton move up to 15 goals after 70 minutes. 20 hand off Matthias Lewidold, and it'll be a free kick for the Toffees. Can we reach 20? Great ball, Mo Bezic. Finds Kevin Morales on the left-hand side. Morales skips infield and finds Nikola Vlasic, who finds himself in front of goal and finds the back of the net for number 16, Nikola Vlasic. Gets his goal, and he'll be hoping that uh, his fellow countrymen for the toughest, Kevin Morales, runs after it. The uh, Evan plays are not taking their foot off the gas here, are they? They want more goals in this game. Kuko Martina. Infield to Umarnias. Vlasic looks for Umarnias again, and Umarnias just about makes it. And it's 17, a second goal for Umarnias. I thought for a moment he. The FC Live is the hashtag. 10 minutes for you to get involved in our interaction this afternoon. We've had a bit of fun with our first game recollections. Umani has desperate for a hat-trick, that's a good save by the keeper, Kevin Morales gets his fifth goal and Everton move on to 18 in the 80th minute of the game. Parried away by the goalkeeper and uh, well steered home by Kevin Morales, five goals for Kevin Morales. I don't think I've ever seen an Everton player score more than five goals. And oh my goodness me, oh no, that is a disaster for Sebastian Schmidt. A peach of an own goal, he's chipped his own goalkeeper. And just when Lawrence Altenberger thought that things couldn't get any worse. A nice little bit of footwork, but too many defenders in his way. Connolly picks it up again for Everton. His left footed plays it back to where he knew that Kevin Morales would be waiting. Great ball, great first touch, decent ball in. Ashley Williams can't get there. Umarnias can, and that is 20. No, it's not. The offside flag is up. Umarnias is denied. He's got a big smile on his face, but uh, I tell you what, he'll, he'll want his hat trick. I've been to rugby games that haven't ended 20 0. <laughs> The uh, scoreboard away to our right-hand side inside the stadium, by the way, still has 19. We're not sure whether it's <laughs> capable of going any higher. And there's that go. No, no. Umar Nias, it's gone in. It's gone in off Umar Nias. And the linesman's flag is down. So Kuko Martin is claiming it. Umar Nias is claiming it. Williams again. Vlasic, wide to Kevin Morales. Vlasic sprints forward, he's on a hat-trick as well of course. Four Everton players have scored hat-tricks. Mo Bezic, he fancies one. No he doesn't. Slides it wide to Kuko Martina and Umarnias gets his fourth goal of the game and Everton go 
22-0 to the good in the 80s.